So he asked me, "Do you are you going to resign again in March with Hostile?" I said, "Probably not. I'm just I just wasn't happy with the company. It has nothing to do with Fuad. It has nothing to do with Warm Revive. It has nothing to do with you know whatever other company." No. Yo, what is good, YouTube? Krishan checking back in with another video. Seems like we have a little bit of drama going on in the bodybuilding world, and I figured I would go ahead and make a video breaking this down quickly so you guys won't have to watch other people make 20 minute videos stretching this topic out longer than it needs to be. So, as you guys may know by now, Nick Walker is no longer with Hostile Subs, and as he said in the beginning of the video, he just wasn't happy with the company. Nothing against Fuad Abiyad. So just to backtrack a little bit, if you guys haven't seen Nick Trigilli's video, you definitely have to check that out to understand this video. I will link it below and I will also link Nick Walker's full breakdown on his Instagram. So basically Nick Trigilli said he talked with Fuad Abiyad on the phone and Fuad was saying that was planning with coming out with a signature series for Nick Walker and releasing it at this year's Mr. Olympia. But in order to do that, Nick Walker had to sign another contract. Now Nick Walker's contract wasn't up until March of next year. And Fuad asked him basically if he wanted to sign again. Now, Nick Trigilli reported that he would have had to sign a two-year contract to do the signature series. And Nick Walker did not want to sign that two-year contract. So Fuad Abiyad did release him from the company. But Nick Trigilli also reported that Fuad Abiyad said Nick Walker was supposed to do our meet and greets and he really didn't want to do that. And Nick Walker debunked that. Trigilli also reported that Nick Walker really didn't want to get a passport. And Nick Walker also debunked it in his defense. So you guys really have to watch these two videos to see what's going on. But honestly, when I watched this video, I felt a little bit off because a lot of this stuff doesn't really sound like Nick Walker. So it basically sounds like Nick Walker just wasn't happy with the company and he wanted to move on. And he said it has nothing to do with him going back to Matt. He said he hasn't talked with Ron Revive at all about getting with them. But that's basically the gist of the whole situation. Nick Walker is no longer with Hostile Subs just because he wasn't happy with the company. He did say he wanted to fulfill his contract, but Fuad Abiy decided to go ahead and let him go early. As always, I hope you guys did indeed enjoy this video, and do not click off this video yet because I am going to play about 50 seconds of Nick Walker's video, but this was just a quick breakdown of the situation, because honestly, that's all it is. I'm Christian from Go Fitness, and that's it. I'm out. Um, and honestly, it just comes down to the vision. Listen, when he has this vision for hostile is just technically not a vision the same vision i have for a company you know we just we didn't we don't see eye to eye and i i think that's okay um but i also didn't necessarily want to leave my contract you know and you know after i got back with matt obviously there was a lot of um speculation if i was going to get back with raw and revive Honest to God, there was no talk of me going back to Raw Revive.